Good morning, day 3. Our lesson for today is identifies odd and even numbers, visualizes and represents fractions that are less than, equal and greater than 1, reads and writes fractions that are less than, equal and greater than 1 in symbols and in words. Odd numbers are numbers whose ones digit or ends with 1, 3, 5, 7, and 9. Example, 29, 461, 843, 6185, 47. These numbers ends with 9, 1, 3, 5, and 7. Even numbers are numbers whose ones digit or ends with 0, 2, 4, 6, and 8. Example, 32, 578, 7914, 10, 936. These are example of even numbers ending in 2, 8, 4, 0, and 6. Fraction represents a part of a whole or a set. Example, the first figure shows one half. The second figure shows one fourth. The third figure shows one third. Proper fractions are fractions whose numerator is always less than to its denominator. Its fractional value is less than 1. Example, 1 fourth, 1 half, 5 tenths, 2 thirds. Improper fractions are fractions equal or greater than 1. If the numerator is equal or the same with the denominator, its fractional value is equal to 1. If the numerator is greater than the denominator, its fractional value is greater than 1. Example, 3 third, 7 seventh, 9 ninth, 5 halves, 8 sixth, 10 third. These are example of improper fractions which are equal to 1 or greater than 1. Mixed number or mixed fractions are fractions greater than 1. It consists of a whole number and a fraction. Example, 2 and 1 half, 3 and 1 fourth, 5 and 3 fourths, 6 and 3 eighths. In reading and writing fractions, read first the numerator as counting numbers then the denominator as ordinal numbers. Example, in symbols, we have two-thirds. In words, we have two-thirds. Second, one-half. Third, three and one-fourth. That is, how to read and write fractions in symbols and in words. That's all for today class. Until next time, see ya!